So anyway, I started blasting. Part eight. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh, I remember this part. Oh, yeah. I love testing. <laughs> Speaking of those movement abilities that you need. Um. <laughs> Oops. Welcome to Pound Town. Yeah. It is a very much a test of your maneuverability skills here. Yeah. And you might think oh, that, a little worm. Huh, you might think that was all for an optional worm, right? <laughs> uh, you haven't seen the worst of it yet. <laughs> it's because it fucking was. Yeah, there are moments in the game like that. Not even just for optional stuff. There are isn't there yeah there's a whole ass sequence near one of the endings at least where it's just pure platforming challenge yes yeah that's yeah oh hey i never even noticed that you could ricochet the pickaxe that's cool yeah yeah oh. pretty, pretty cool that's neat i didn't know this uh that's pretty cool. cute cat <laughs> <laughs> you, you guys and get him uh, I'm surprised that that beam did not hit you like that. Yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> There's, there is no second frame. It's only frame one and three. Frame one and three. <laughs> oh, man. We're breaking Hollow Knight rules every second. Right. And then because we broke those rules, we're getting lost and we can't figure shit out. Oh, more so. You're getting lost. <laughs> as, as I'm like watching Hollow Knight, I keep, you know, having the things like, you know, maybe I should probably actually try to like play this on my own at some point. But then I'm also like, man, the map is so big. I'm not going to be able to retain any of that information. I would get lost so easily. <laughs> you will get lost easily if you play this game. <laughs> I mean, like, you said it last part, but you feel like looking at the map while you're playing it is a form of cheating. Oh no, not looking at the the complete map, just like the map with all the collectibles and stuff on yeah, it. Yeah, that's what I mean. Or like a, a map with like the hidden rooms unlocks. Uh-huh. Cuz there's there's like breakable walls and stuff that you just would have no idea unless you were like actively looking for them. Yeah. And I, I feel like that's kind of cheating to really? be able to cause you just pass by map shards. So you you would feel like it would um ruin some of that intentional experience yeah it would, it would ruin kind of like the whole uh, like oh cool i found this item in the middle of, of uh nowhere <laughs> in the middle of fucking nowhere <laughs> yeah yeah because like see this is one of the parts that i was thinking of like the, the interactive map labels this part right here as a cheat slash skip um oh yeah yeah. I did not know this was a cheat skip. I just thought this was like something that you were supposed to do. No, hard. It, it's it's not. I'm not sure why, but maybe it looks like you could do that. Maybe it's expecting you to get the double jump. Maybe. But uh, it could yeah. also be a intentional one since you do have the ability to pogo off of the pickaxes. So maybe. I don't know, though. But... Any, no, nonetheless, it's uh, it's labeled on the interactive map as a cheat slash skip. So, but, okay. good God, I hate those fucking things. Okay, but like I, whenever I, I do play these types of games, I sometimes like to have a map on me, just like on my other monitor, so I can look at, <laughs> you know, create a strategy for myself, create a pathway for myself, you know. <laughs> It really does make sense for a game like this, where getting lost is like just another afternoon. Mhm. Mm but like, it, it, yeah, because my my thinking is like it could one help me get a lot of collectibles and two um, negate a lot of that uh, backtracking that I would intentionally be making myself unintentionally making myself do rather. You know. Yeah, it's a huge time saver. Right. Yeah. So, like, 
I, I guess it's that question of like whether there should be shame of using <laughs> guides hands on while you're playing a game, you know? Oh, I think for the most part, th there are certain games that are just too big not to use a guide, like AKA Skyrim. Mm. That game's just way too big not to use a guide, in my opinion, anyway. I see. <laughs> Mega Man ZX. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, God, the map in that game is garbage. <laughs> yeah, I, I have I have seen the map, so... Yeah, it's a... Uh, I, th I, th I think I've shown it to you. <laughs> <laughs> I Yeah, I, ha I have seen the, uh, the original map. Dear God, that's awful. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's why I made effort into 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 making it readable myself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. So that's. See, there's no shame there because that map system was objectively awful. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That one was just really confusing. You like you're. You're pretty much required to have like to look up an actual map if you if, if you don't want to get like if you don't, you don't want to run around in circles forever. <laughs> POV, you're playing GTA 6 and you have to actually pull up a real map, <laughs> like a legitimate paper map of a real place. <laughs> <laughs> pull up <a> GTA <laughs> going on a road trip. <laughs> you're going on a GTA 6 road trip and it's been three hours and you're lost. <laughs> Oh man, I didn't know GTA 6 the map was going to be the entire the entire US. <laughs> GTA 6 is the entire United States. Yeah. That'd be crazy. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, no wonder it's taken so long. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. It's Los Santos again. Oh, well. Oh god. That'd be so fucked. I mean, they always have a different setting with every game, so. Yeah. I've heard the thing specifically with, like, 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 do you think that we need a uh, GTA 6 because we've had 5 for so long and people still actively pay, play 5, not just the campaign, but online stuff as well? Here's the thing. With a active, uh, a live service game, it's really hard to make a sequel. That's also true. Because no matter what you do, uh, it's gonna be it, your next game has to live up to not only the base game, but whatever you add to it. And that's is a tall order for anybody. Yeah, and it's also a common practice when they do do that, they shut down the servers of the previous one. Yes. So, like take art for example. They're they're shutting the servers down. Like what? The, oh, Ark. They're they're shutting this. The yes, Arc yes, I heard about that one. <laughs> oh wow. They they made a remaster, and uh, they're shutting down the servers for the old one. Uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah uh, this is something I was talking with Cameron yesterday uh, for, during a uh, Modern Warfare Two actually. Um, like, uh, if there are multiplayer centric games, I'd at least appreciate everyone to like have single player content not necessarily campaign just something you could do single player <laughs> even if it is very bare bones but like my broader point being is that um one day those servers are going going to go offline which means a you have now just wasted a whole bunch of discs classic uh people's time and all that stuff uh, because you just shut down the servers and there's literally no point of playing that game again or and think of all the people that That's freaking That's kind of why I like PC because with PC people could just make their own fan servers No, I didn't I mean, even... people can do that for other games too I didn't, I didn't, like, I... <laughs> People are just still are still playing Splatfest in the first Splatoon game <laughs> <laughs> I have the servers shut down for that uh, Splatoon. Splatoon one. Uh, probably yeah. I mean, I mean, is because because that that's like the 3ds and Wii U era, and so yeah. the, the online probably in general for that doesn't work anymore. But <laughs> you can mod it. <laughs> I guess yeah. I don't. I don't know what they still support with the Wii U. Um, because they they did they did take away the eShop. Um. Oh yeah, they did do that. Yeah, they took stuff off the eShop. 
Yeah, or like they well, just could, took away the, the ability uh, to be shopping at all. The first thing I hear from Landon uh, when uh, that's that happened was like, you know, I'm about to uh, somebody already monitor uh, what's it called 3ds to just not need the Wii shop the Wii shop. Yeah, there are some like bootleg stuff and all that, so you can get all the 3ds stuff. But I just mean like uh, servers in general, because yeah, I don't know about the Splatoon one or even the Smash Four servers if they're still online. Um, <laughs> I don't yeah, see that, like, no. the thing. And all the dear fans God, are... what? Yeah, the, fucking, the grub turned into a, mimic. a monster. That's what we call a min mimic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So die. That's also what the the hunter calls them, grub mimics. And apparently, you're supposed to kill four of them to unlock the thing. And I only ever found the one. Well, nice. <laughs> yeah, uh, live action, like live, live service, live mm -hmm. service games. Yeah, the, World of Warcraft is another one that's kind of like that. Although they're still up, right? I was gonna say, yeah. isn't World of Warcraft still going? Yeah. Yes, it is, but it's like, there's not really any plan to make a sequel to it because how are you gonna make a sequel to it? Oh well, okay. When you put it like that, yeah, that that makes sense. Universe of War of Warcraft. <laughs> no, that that's just the thing. Like, I really wish that because because. It is. I think. I think it is inevitable that you know one day all these live service stuffs are going to go down, and yeah. whether it be like tomorrow or ten years from now, whatever it may be. Here's I, the thing. Uh -huh. it, they, it could be multiple things that the reason it goes down, and people lose everything they once had. Because here's the thing: if the server, or if the location where the servers are being hosted is like has is for some reason destroyed. Like that fire somehow happens. <laughs> yeah. Uh, if they don't have a backup of it on like a different location, everybody who's ever played that game will lose everything they had. Hmm. It's. Yeah. Like, yes, live service games are are like. Don't get me wrong; they're pretty fun. Some of them. But I, Some of them. It, <laughs> it's... It doesn't always go... It, the prospect of knowing that they're gonna be down one day is like... Eh, it, 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 there's two perspectives. Because I feel like you were like... Why, I feel like you feel like it, there's no point in actually playing them at all. Or... or no, no, no. I'm not, I'm not saying playing them. I'm saying buying them not knowing that the servers are down. That's what I mean. Cause, oh, like oh, if they're already down? Yeah. Okay. I'm Because what I'm referring to really is like, because there are physical copies of Overwatch out there, the first one, and um, the servers are no longer a thing for Overwatch oh, 1. So some poor, yeah. soul, some poor soul is going to be on the internet wanting to like, hey, Overwatch 2 was fun, so I want to play the first one and see what was up with that. Oh, I just put in a blank disc, essentially. I think I just boot you to do Overwatch 2. Even on, um, like, ye old PS4 copies? <laughs> I don't know, I think so. On uh, PS4 copies, actually, probably. Oh, maybe. Because I, I wouldn't see why they would not... I think it's ports for, like, the last generation as well. Maybe? I honestly don't know about that. Okay, I'm pretty sure I can play on, three, six, uh, not, no, on six, the six. Xbox One. Well, I don't, I don't know. Like, and I'm assuming you don't know either. <laughs> no. Yeah, I, yeah, I honestly don't know what would happen if you put in an Overwatch one disc into your system. Right oh no, because like here's the reason I'm saying this is because like Overwatch the app, uh, app the icon. Yeah. For. For fucking the Xbox, it literally just transferred over to Overwatch two. Oh really? Yes. The only reason I know is because my brother plays Overwatch, and he's like, "Oh yeah, no, it just turned into Overwatch 2. Really? Okay. 
I mean, that sounds about accurate, because I don't think they really even added a whole lot of new stuff to Overwatch 2 originally. <laughs> oh, wait, POV. wasn't, wasn't freaking... Isn't Overwatch 2 free? Is it? Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah. Cause, but, like, all the... How they get their money is because of all those stupid freaking microtransactions. Microtransactions. Yeah, <laughs> okay. Okay. Buy this skin for $20. Just the one skin for $20. A skin. Ugh. <laughs> That's pretty much Fortnite. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This skin for $20. And all the simps are like, good God, take my money. Take it. Okay. <laughs> uh, you should get that looked at. <laughs> the knights, the knights' knees are fine. He'll be, he'll be, he'll be fine. Trust me. He's fine. He's fine. <laughs> End <of the> game. <laughs> <laughs> He's fine. Especially with all that jumping he's been doing. <laughs> if platformer characters actually felt the muscles in their legs <laughs> <laughs> the platformer characters are like yeah my my feet and my feet broke hours ago and i pulled all my muscles hours ago no they'd, they'd be like they'd be like how the fuck did i double jump like what even is that i can't i can't jump again in midair there's nothing to bo boost myself off of it was just air. <laughs> that's, that's, like, that's like, just eat the potion. What do you mean, eat the potion? Just eat the potion. Eat the potion, yeah. What do you mean, eat the potion? Didn't you mean drink it? No, I mean, eat it. Yeah. Eat, yeah. It, all. eat it, Adam, <laughs> like eat everyone it. else. Just eat the glass after you drink it. That's what I do. Crikey. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Upside down, wordy. Oh, yes. Oh, uh, here's another one. Uh, fire one bullet. All right, time to reload. So I take a, the full clip out and then put a new one in. <laughs> <laughs> Even though that old clip has like nine bullets left in it. No, no, it's fine. It's, it's still in your, it's still on the number thing. <laughs> it's still on the number thing. Right, yeah, yeah. That's how it works. That's how, yep. Always. Because that is a thing. I, pr I promise. <laughs> Can't wait to do that in real life. <laughs> wait a minute. Where's all my bullets? <laughs> you go to a gun store and you complain to the guy, Hey, yeah, so I reloaded my mag and I dropped it on the ground. And now I don't have that mag or all of that ammo. What the hell? This is false advertising. <laughs> <laughs> false advertising. <laughs> why, why the fuck would that be false advertisement? <laughs> Let me like faulty. Uh, what's it called? The faulty production. I mean, yeah, yeah. Call faulty production. Maybe. Product, Malfunction. Product flaw or something. I know what you Planned mean. Planned obsolescence. Yeah. <laughs> You're like, oh no, do I want to be here? No, I don't want to be here. <laughs> it gets creepier. Wait, what? Oh. Oh. So is that what you were waiting for earlier? Yes, half of them have another spider in them. Oh, I see. I like seeing you think really hard about the next challenge ahead. <laughs> the amount of spiders crawling around the background just gives me even more of the heebie. I I I hate spiders. Oh so, really? Yeah. Um. And you kill one of them, and just a bunch of spiders crawl over its body. Oh no oh, way! way. Gross. I can't believe this. God. I mean, Big spiders, yeah. Um, oh god, <laughs> hey, there's a big spider. Yeah, <laughs> like that. That thing has it, its face 
turns into blades. That's disgusting. <laughs> oh no. And then you have to explore <laughs> down there to find your dead body. Nice. Uh, I died at the end. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, you did. You died right there. Yeah, it's a big old. You have a big old arachnophobia. Yeah. The night perish in the middle of the spider den. Will he? Will he survive? Will he get his ghost back? Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. Dude, this next Dragon episode looks fucking weird. <laughs> yeah. Dragon Ball looks a little different from what I remember. <laughs> Go Goku? Goku. The night makes night noises. Goku gets over his arachnophobia. <laughs> Goku sees a spider, blows up the entire planet. <laughs> <laughs>